Marseille travelled to Bordeaux on Sunday night, knowing that a win would put them top of Ligue 1, though their last victory at Stade Chevron Delma was back in October 1977. Bordeaux, who thrashed Lorient 4-0 last week, had a chance to jump to second if they took all three points. In the 13th minute, the visitors came forward with Mathieu Valbuena, who scored a remarkable goal for France in midweek. He squared for Morgan Amalfitano, who tried his luck from 25 yards. Cedric Carrasso not making the best save of his career, but at least clearing the danger. An early let-off for the hosts. Bordeaux reacted from a Ludovic Abraniak corner. Henri Seve headed on goal, but Jeremy Morel was well placed to head clear. Charles Cabore finally booting the danger away. Seve getting ahead of Lucas Mendes and Steve Mandanda, but the ball clearly kept out by Morel. Into the 40th minute, and Marseille had another chance after a defensive misunderstanding between Mariano and Enrique. Morel took advantage and crossed into the box for Andre Ayou, whose shot was well blocked by Cedric Carrasso. Nil-nil at the break. Into the second half and the night was about to improve for Francis Gillo and his men. Jaroslav Plazil found Benoit Tremolinas down the left. He crossed into the Marseille area and Johan Gufran got ahead of Nicolas Unkelou to slide home his sixth goal of the season. 1-0 to Bordeaux with 52 minutes played. There was little else to report in the second period, though in injury time, Bordeaux came forward, Nicolas Maurice Bully slipping the ball through to a Braniac. He was unceremoniously brought down by last defender Lucas Mendes. Referee Lionel Gioffredo brandished a red card, leaving Marseille with 10 men for the last kick of the game. An excellent through ball from Maurice Bully and Mendes clearly beaten when he chose to bring a Braniac down. One nil to Bordeaux at the final whistle. They stretched their unbeaten home run against Marseille to 36 years.